is going on YouTube family? It is your girl Ray back to you guys with another video. As you guys can tell by the title of this video, we're going to be talking about the expectations and what you should expect to happen when being on your weight loss journey or while being on your weight loss journey. If you're interested in this video, make sure you go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Do not forget to press that bell notification so that you'll be notified every single time your girl uploads a video. So when you are on your weight loss journey, these things I'm gonna tell you guys are gonna be things that's gonna be like, well, why are you telling me this? Like, aren't you supposed to be encouraging me to do this? Blah, 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 blah. I'm gonna encourage you to do and to be as humanly or as human as you possibly can. Like, I don't want you to expect all these great things to happen when they're probably nine times out of 10 may not happen. They may not happen the way that you want them to. But I just want to show you that it's okay to be human. It's okay for these things to happen. And it's okay to be discouraged. The first thing is you are going to fall off. Accept it. You're going to fall off. You're going to fall off your journey. You're going to fall off your eating habits. You're going to fall off with your exercise routine. It is going to happen. And it is okay. As long as you don't let this happen all the time if you pick yourself up after you fall off you're gonna be fine if you consistently 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 let yourself keep going down 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 you're gonna find yourself in a situation where you're gonna be back in a hole again it's gonna happen it, it's bound to happen you're gonna fall off your journey you're going to be in a space where you're not gonna eat as healthy as you should you're not gonna be exercising as often as you should you're going to fall off and guess what that's okay it's gonna happen it, it happens to all of us no matter what fitness influencer you look at no matter what trainer no matter what they always fall off somewhere somehow their fall off might not be as great as others they may fall off for a couple of days and they get back some people may fall off for a week and they get back it happens all the time a couple of days it's okay maybe a week it's okay just don't let it get any worse than that please expect to go up and down in your weight it's gonna happen <laughs> like literally it, it it that's normal it's going to happen why because you get inconsistent you know you get irritated you get frustrated it's gonna happen you're gonna go up and down in your weight it's okay it's okay if it happens that way just don't let the weight become too crazy if you go down a couple of pounds great and that's exactly what you're looking for if you go up a pound or so that's okay that's totally fine just get back on track if you're at a plateau that's also okay if you're at a plateau for too long however there may be things we need to change inside of your diet there may be things in your lifestyle we have to start changing um or, or start adjusting i should say but for the most part if if you're in a situation where the scale is just plateau it's totally fine the scale most likely will move so just keep at it keep consistent don't let the scale be your end all be all. Don't let the scale tell you that you're terrible. Don't let the scale tell you that you're you're amazing. Let you and your hard work show you that you're amazing and that you can make this work. This is going to tie into number one and number two. Expect to get frustrated. Expect to want to give up. Expect to be at the point where you're like, the scale's not moving. I've been eating healthy. I've been doing this. I've been doing that. Nothing's working. Nothing ever works for me. I don't feel like going to the gym today. I'm sore. I'm tired. I don't want to do this anymore. This is too hard. This is too much. But you can do it. You can make it happen. You can do it. All you have to do is keep pushing forward. That's all you have to do. And that's actually very, very hard just to push forward. But you can make it happen you can make this happen don't get frustrated and if you do get frustrated again it's normal to get frustrated but just don't let your frustration control what your goals are and where you're trying to go when it comes to, when it comes to your fitness journey okay your frustration should not outweigh the good things that you've done thus far and it should not outweigh where you're trying to go so if you're gonna get frustrated it's okay but don't let that be your answer for quitting this journey expect to feel exhausted expect to feel mentally drained expect to feel emotionally drained by this entire journey expect it why because it's going to happen 
you on a journey. The journey is not just a straight shot. A journey is loops and bounds and mountains and hills and wrong turns and learning and understanding and, and throwing fits. Like it's going to happen. You're gonna just wanna give up. You're not gonna wanna do it anymore. I mean, who wants to wake up every single day at five o'clock in the morning, hit the gym, and then trying to live an everyday life after that? It sounds great. Of course, we all wanna do it, and some people can do it without a problem, but guess what? The reason why they're able to do it all the time is because they stay consistent throughout the entire journey. So if they stay consistent throughout their journey, just like you should stay consistent throughout your journey, you're going to realize that things are going to get better. They're gonna become easier not saying you're not going to get frustrated once they become easier but push through those moments that you don't want to go to the gym push through those moments that you don't want to eat healthy push through those moments that you don't want to continue this journey because i will tell you firsthand a weight loss journey is something it's a whole different beast a weight loss journey is a whole different beast it's something you have never experienced if you've never done it before it's one of those things like, oh my God, like I'm literally changing my entire life for this entire, yes, you have to change everything, your mental space, your eating, your thinking, your timing, your planning, everything has to be surrounded with your health at that point. You know, it's, it's not just going off a whim and just going to work out every blue moon whenever I feel like it and just doing two shoulder taps and just be done. Like that's not how life is once you start a weight loss journey. It gets real once you start a journey and it gets very tough. So don't give up push through those moments now two positive things i want you guys to expect is expect to be proud of yourself celebrate those moments those times where you've lost a pound you've lost two pounds celebrate those moments celebrate those victories of my pants fit much better even though the scale may not show anything but my clothes fit better even though the scale may not show anything, but I feel better. My skin looks better. My body feels better. Um, I'm not as swollen, you know. I'm thinking a lot differently. I'm eating a lot. Like, celebrate all those things that you've never done before this journey. Celebrate all of that. Celebrate the small wins. Celebrate the non-scale victories. And if you don't know what a non-scale victory is, it's something that you can't value by just weighing yourself on the scale. The scale can't tell you how good your clothes are fitting. The scale can't tell you or show you how well you're doing with your body <clears throat> and what progress you've made. It can't show you that outside of just showing you that the, the pounds are still there and it's really hard to get rid of them. Don't let the scale dictate where your journey is going to go. And lastly, guys, expect to reach your goals. Don't expect the worst. Don't expect that you're never going to reach your goals. Don't ever expect that you're never going to hit those goals. Expect that. Expect that you're going to get to where you want to be, but you're going to have challenges along the way. And these challenges are going to be frustrating. They're going to be annoying. They're going to be, um, they're, they're, they're going to discourage you sometimes, but it should be something that's going to encourage you to be better. And it should be something that's going to motivate you to be um, where you should be going forward in your weight loss journey. So this video is going to be very short. It shouldn't have been very long at all. I just want to give you guys a few things just to kind of ease your mind you're gonna do well you're gonna be great throughout your journey just remember where you're going and where you came from just remember that it's okay to be set back sometimes it's okay to be emotionally drained that's gonna happen as long as you don't stay there you're gonna be fine throughout your journey i hope this video helped you guys to understand what to expect throughout your weight loss journey and i hope that your weight loss journey is going great if it's not it's perfectly fine just make sure you just find different ways of doing things it's okay to try something new it's okay to venture out and try something out of your comfort zone because it may work for you and it may not but you'll never know unless you try it so i hope this helped you guys and if you like this video make sure you go ahead and like comment subscribe do not forget to press that bell notification so you'll be notified every single time i upload a video all right guys see y'all guys later mm.